What's up, everybody? OMB. Hey, look, I appreciate y'all subscribing to the channel. Do subscribe if you're not subscribed. And hit that bell icon so you can be notified for future videos. Just wanted to make sure this thing stays squared on me. You know what I'm saying? Well, uh, if I'm correct, we got a fight tonight, y'all. A fight with a little controversy on it. But um, that would be Artur Betabiev versus Callum Smith. Now, I've watched Artur Betabiev. Woo, boy, that boy hit hard, man. He's a hard-hitting son of a bee. If I'm correct, 19 wins and 19 KOs. Zero losses. You know what I'm saying? Um, the controversy is with elevated testosterone levels in the test that um, Artur Betabiev had took. But yet, they said the ones that were done, and that says early as January 15th and December were all considered inconclusive. Now, this particular elevated testosterone finding was not conclusive. You know what I'm saying? They just found ele elevated levels. Now, from my understanding and from what I read, it's two ways, it's two things that, that can happen. One thing is you could be taking, you know, um, PEDs. But the other thing is, is they said that um, you can find elevated testosterone levels in men if they're excited or if they're angry, getting ready to fight, you know, stuff like that. You know, I'm not sure how much, but enough. But anyway, these elevated testosterone levels are enough for Eddie Hearn and Callum Smith in their corner to be skeptical of Artur better be as. Basically, they're pushing so hard on this that I'm thinking that Eddie Hearn and Callum Smith already know that they're going to lose this fight. And from what it seems like, because all this stink just popped up about um, Arto Better Biev and the elevated testosterone levels, um, is their way of conceding, is the way of Eddie Hearn and his team is conceding defeat before the fight even happened. You know what I'm saying? So, um, who do I think is going to win? I've only seen Callum Smith a couple times. He's a decent fighter, but Artur Betabiev is straight, come in, seek, destroy. Okay, I felt your power. You hurt me a little something, something. Well, here's mine. Them the fighters I like to watch. You know what I'm saying? So after work, I'll be coming in on the main event or right before the main event, I get off at that time and I'm going to be hightailing it to the house to go see this fight. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, I hate I hate to miss out on good fights. But as far as um, Artur better be a pushing 40 years old, um, he did his thing on his last fight, but uh, he didn't look, oh, he got hurt a couple times in his last fight. You know what I'm saying? I think he was a bit over anxious there. And, you know, you know, uh, his opponent had something to say about that, even though his opponent did get TKO'd. You know what I'm saying? So I'm looking for an interesting fight tonight. Y'all tell me what y'all think in the comment section. OMB signing out. Peace.